Okay. <laughs> She's just like, okay. I guess I'll just have a sit about it. I guess I'll just go sit down for a while. Come back. Rose, you having a time? What was that? What was that? Where did Tor go? What on earth do you mean, Sokka? Tor is resting in the wellness center. I just saw Remember? that. What? We both saw him go into the pond. <laughs> okay. Are you fucking with me? Or, or is this a story again? Now, now. Let's cool it with the language. Let's cool it with the She's condescension, really Rose. Why? It's time to get profiled, bitch. Tell me. Rose watched Tora go into the pond. Why is she lying to me? Do you, it's it's crazier for you to deny it at this point. Number one fan. The hero will say Wake has returned. We're all characters in his story. G Wiz. G Wiz. I'm fucking character. But I can use that phrase to make Rose stop lying to me. Tell me. Wake has returned. Tell me, tell me everything I need to know. Cynthia took Tor. What happened to her? When the darkness touches your head, your bookshelf gets shuffled. I put her lamp in the shoe box. What do you call a lamp lady without her lamp? Is Rose talking about Cynthia or herself? Oh, now Alan has it. Or both. Oh, so the lamp we picked up in... The lamp we picked up in the dark place was Cynthia's lamp. Right? Like it had to be. Tor disappeared into the pond. It's another overlap. It's always it another overlap. Be. How do I get inside? We're gonna figure it out. Uh, let's see, Rose to, uh, to look for the hero. She won't help anyone else, okay. Well, that's me, so we gotta convince her. Wait, hold on. I gotta zoom out. Uh, stood in front of the small gathering. I guess that's the last piece of thing for Ilmo. Yeah. Do we have anything more? No, not yet. That's all later. All stuff for later. Rose. Wake has returned. Oh my god. You're the hero. You're here to save Alan. I feel so silly for trying to keep you out of the wellness center. I locked Torangale in there after they lost it, and I didn't want you getting hurt. <laughs> Before I forget, here's the page Wake told me to give you. Oh, and you'll need my keys to get around. This is bizarre. You're strange. But we we done know that. Saga jabbed the selector on the jukebox. We, we done knew the missing that. record in its place. Saga couldn't have found it without Odin's help. A light bloomed in through the garden window. The horror story beat me to Tor. Okay. I have to rescue him. The key to this overlap is an old Gods of Asgard record. Well, Odin we're going to figure more. it out. We're going to do it. All right, um, wait. We still don't have the thing that we need to do this. So until then, we're gonna go back inside. We don't know which record we need yet. Uh, where did we not? There is mostly rooms upstairs, right? That we didn't get to unlock. Uh, conversation, new choices. Who can we talk to and what's new about it? It is now safe in here, which implies that it's not safe somewhere else. I don't like that implication. The implication that it is no longer safe. No. Back into Rose's office. Oh, hello, everybody. 
You all should stay out here a while. Until it's safe. Yeah, you stay stay over there. I'm happy to get out of that house. It's not good. Isn't it strange that I've lived in Bright Falls my whole life and I can't remember this building? The house has always been here, Norman. Remember when that poor Nora girl drowned in the bunker? Those Andersons got it so cheap because it's haunted. <laughs> you get what you pay for. I mean, what's not haunted in Bright Falls at this point, right? Is there right? anyone who didn't show up? A few. Artie, Gil, Cynthia. If oh. they aren't here by now, then they aren't coming. It's important to be punctual. On that topic, I'd like to point out that our nightly decaf coffee service is almost half an hour behind schedule. Well, things are things are fucked. Have any of you noticed anything? Things are not great right now. Ms. So you're, you hold it on your Just decaf. The Torah won't leave the poor woman alone. That brute wants one thing and one thing only. Who's making the crude remarks now? Right, bossy. Take a swim in the pond, Norman. Drink some water, Norman. Well, no one tells Norman McDonald what to do. Good, you shouldn't have listened to her. She's she's bad. Hello there. Are you Pat Maine from the radio? That's me. And you're the federal agent everyone's been talking you're, about. I, I forget. Is he the guy from the radio you in the have first time game for too? An interview at some point. I mean, once oh, this is all sorry. over, maybe. I'm kind of in a hurry right now. Love your show though. Very informative. Mm, thank you. Never compromise on quality. That's my motto. That's a good motto. Uh, we'd be happy to have you on the show any time. Well, we'll figure it out, you know. You talk to uh, my people, we'll talk to your people. We'll we'll figure it out. Mandy May, are you all right? You're bleeding. Oh. How did that happen? Oh no, Mandy May. What the fuck? Oh, no. Oh, don't be a crybaby, Norman. It's nothing. I just poked my finger knitting this monster of a blanket i don't know if that's the case what happened to you oh no mandy may oh god everything is terrible couldn't wait this is the manuscript page Manuscript. Odin stuck in bed. Odin Anderson stirred in his bed, his vision hazy, smudged. He felt weighted down by an ocean of dark water. Through the haze, he made out Saga. Odin felt useless. He wished he could tell Saga how his silly faces made her smile when she was young, too young to remember. Odin used to joke that Tor was her grandfather, but he was the all father. He smiled at the memory. Odin was the kinder of the Anderson brothers. Tor lacked patience, more volatile. The brothers fought a lot, but they were inseparable. Now Tor was missing, dragged into darkness. Odin could feel it. Time was running out for both of them. Well, that's not good. Ooh, Odin has a new profile. The record. The page mentions a missing record. Do you know where it is, Odin? Driven by passion. Raging like a storm. Your grandfather made the song to apologize. To who? To, to what? To your mother, Freya, and to you. Tours like a storm. Your mother did the right thing, leaving with you. Even if it broke your grandfather's heart. And mine. Listen to the song, Saga. It's all there. Tor only had one record made. He keeps it in the museum. Odin knows my mom's name. He's saying my mom took me away when I was still a baby. Plausible. <laughs> Plausible. Task. The record is in the museum. That could have happened. <laughs> Maybe. Wait, which one was his room? Oh, it's down here. Odin? Is he dreaming? I 
Oh, he's he's still out of it. Okay. That's fine. All right, whose room was locked previously? We went to Donna's room. I guess it was the Old Gods of Asgard Museum. But I want to go check out upstairs first. Maybe not. Maybe we'll just go in. Let me in. Let me in. What's that? Oh, of course. <laughs> Cynthia. Remorse. This is the one. But it's gone. Cynthia. Cynthia record. She will tell me where to find it. Cynthia. How dare you? You do this every time. Rude. Absolutely. Unbelievably rude. Uh, wait, hold on. Uh, connection to, yeah, there we go. Why did mom leave? Uh, jab the selector of the missing record in this place. Uh, wait, hold on. Overlap ritual. There we go. The page says the record will open the overlap. Or is the page predetermining it? That's... Am I just playing into the story? You know, that's... That's the question. That's really... Wait, hold on. There was also... We could profile Odin again. Anger's remorse is missing. Who took it? Our shame becomes the pale horse. Oh, Tor, bro. Tor's love for you is in that song. That's why Cynthia wants it, to ruin him. She can't she have made it. made Tor lust after her. Gross. We fought one scratching hag years ago. Now he's fallen for another, and we might lose him for good. One less Anderson. Well, we don't want That's that. Going to happen. We really don't. Cynthia has torn the overlap. We're gonna get him. We're gonna and save him. Morse is the key to get there. We're gonna. I need to make Cynthia put Cynthia Weaver in retirement. Oh God. Cynthia targeted Tor specifically. Why him? Deal with a nasty Anderson fellow. His heart was broken. Cancelled. Cancelled. Started appearing. It was too late. Shut her out of her own case. The dark presence is using Cynthia to keep me from talking to Tor. It knows. It knows it'll be bad. Angus remorse now. He is a young girl in love. A broken role to exist. The shadows to come alive. A gift. And on of death she has the record. I can get it out of her. Huh. Where is it? Anger's remorse. Tell me where it where is. Where is it, Cynthia? Please. I I asked nicely. Too many hands. The bathroom frightened her. Cut short. She screamed. And oh. Folks, it's in a tub. Of course it's in a tub. The Angus Remorse record is in Cynthia's room. In her bathtub. We're gonna get it. We're gonna get it out of her tub. Alright. Alright, so Cynthia took the record and I brought it back. We found it. They got crazy. The Andersons got got wild. Uh, I mean, it's only a single room. Could you really call this a museum? I guess you could. All right. So upstairs is where all of our goodness is. If I get jump scared by fucking Cynthia Weaver again, I'm going to lose my goddamn mind. Ati? Ati, I want to talk to you. Why are you in here alone? Well, I know why you're in here alone, but why, why are you making me worry about it? I don't want to worry about you. Do you know anything about the cult of the tree? 
Yes, yes. He who reaches for a spruce tree will stumble into a juniper. Huh? Plum was one of them. He has kicked empty. <laughs> what? I wouldn't want to be in his shoes. Uh oh. But I like his shoes. You say Blum was in the cult, but How we did. did you know we knew Blum that was much. Part of the cult. Oh, Fox never runs out of tricks. He's a crazy man, and he will show his ways. <laughs> Bloom like to talk. <laughs> but where is he now? Where is he, Ati? Do we ever go into Mandy Nay's room? I don't think so, right? Yeah, you can see she's been... God, she's been busy, huh? She's been knitting a lot. Oh, God. So many bad... Like, I don't... Maybe we're... Maybe it's because we're gonna need them, but... We haven't gotten this many batteries in a long time. Uh, Norman's room. There was nothing in there earlier. This is Gail's room. Well, Gail's dead. He got turned into a tank and, and he died. So now we're going to get this manuscript page out of his room. Let's see. Play Lewis the narration. set up a foundation with the sales of their greatest hits album. He used the cash to build a nursing facility. The old men deserved it. An old manor in Bright Falls. Wheeler hired a contractor to have it refitted as an old folks care home. At this point, Wheeler felt good about himself. <laughs> he would. Gold. No need to feel guilty. Wheeler left guilty the about to what? the contractor and returned to oh, New York City. He had done his part. It was time to turn over a new leaf. The contractors figured out Wheeler was gone for good. They took the money and ran. Oh, great. When the fall rains came, the leaks started appearing. Huh. Huh. Barry, this is why you don't leave. This is why you always watch and wait. Okay, well. I guess we could go into that room, but. Motherfucking. Auntie? What has been has caught. But trouble doesn't look like this. You can go to the basement and check the generator. Yes, please. But you can never know in which street the devil sits. Ati? The basement. What the fuck yes. does that mean? Wait, hold on. Where's the entrance to the basement? Yeah, we can't get into any of the rooms because that is happening. Um... No, we can only get into the basement from outside. Great. All right, Cynthia. Stop it. Stop moving through the water. <sighs> all right, is everybody good outside? Are you all good? All right, well, the lights are... The lights are still fine out there, I guess. Oh, it's on the, hold on, it's on the other side. We got confused, that's all. I just got turned around, that's all. Out the wellness center door. Oh Lord. So the basement is like here. Where is basement? I don't like that sound. Rose? Hold on. Hold on. Oh my god, get out of the fucking... Get out of the fucking way! You die. 
Oh god. You go down. Where did you- you're not even a thing. You're just like a normal ass person. Get down, Mr. President. All right, we got him. God, okay. Hold on, we're out of, funny enough, <laughs> we're out of, uh, we're out of flares. Didn't see that coming. Considering we have a million of them inside of our fucking shoe box. Did you drop anything? Can I have anything? No, okay. Okay. What's over here? We didn't come over here before, right? We never even came in here. Oh, this is the wellness center. We're good. All right. Which means that the basement is over here. So I could get out of the fucking water. It's bad in there. The water is poisonous. Why is the basement flooded? I ask like that's... No. Shit. Cynthia. I need to get the power back on. Yeah, we do. Keep Immediately. Good without power. Oh God. Oh, this is not a good time. This sucks. Unequivocally. What's this? Remember, buy more fuses. Many more crap. Great. I'm so glad that we're out of fuses again. This is the manuscript page. Uh, let Wheeler me... used to be the agent of a manic depressive celebrity writer, Alan Wake. Wake had various addictions on his back. An on-off death wish. Wheeler had seen a thing or two. Wheeler paid a lot of money for a good shrink. Got himself convinced that all the nightmares he'd seen leading up to Wake drowning himself were just his imagination. PTSD. Now we had pills to keep the shadows from his sleep. But the Andersons were something else. The nightmares were starting to creep in again. Or maybe it was the drugs in the air. It was always the drugs. We it was never not the drugs. It was the drugs. He really the hoped Andersons it was the drugs. So Great, old. I'm glad. Vampires. After every gig in the party that followed, it took them weeks to bounce back. And they never did completely. Each time Wheeler expected them to croak. Barry, you suck. It sucks, Barry. You suck. Fuse is blown. God damn it. Maybe oh, there's spares wait, nearby. Cynthia? You goddamn. Oh my god, hold on. We need none of this. I'll tell you what we do need. We do need. We're gonna take flares. Because I know we're gonna actually use them. I think we're good otherwise. Yeah, we should be fine. We should be fine. Everything should be good. All right. So we need a fuse. Must be locked from Yeah, the of other course side. it's locked from the other side. Wouldn't be a video game if there was not what the lock door is locked from one side or the other. Can I open any of these? Okay, more shotgun shells. That's good. We do need more shotgun shells. Spare fuses now locked away because someone uh, Ati keeps stealing them. Code is in the laundry room. All right, the code to the safe is in the laundry room. Where is the laundry room? 
This is another manuscript page. Emmett taken. Emmett Elwood had had enough. Emmett Elwood. All his life, he'd been surrounded by the same small-minded, impolite, ignorant people in town. Their endless gossip, their nose picking, chewing food with their mouths open, Emmett Elwood. not washing their hands after visiting the restroom. We haven't touching things, touching everything. The world was going to hell. We haven't met him, have he we? He watched day after day how all the nice things in life in Bright Falls were spoiled and ruined forever. I cannot recall Emmett Elwood would be a just being somebody that reckoning. we've heard of. Emmett had imagined many times how we'd make them pay. He had lovingly tended his anger, made it grow hotter. It was out in the open now. Ugly and slobbering, they reached at him with their unwashed hands. He beat them down, beat them until they no longer moved. And then he'd wash his hands with a strong antibacterial disinfectant. Um. Yeah, that's normal. That's a very normal way to think about things. So, so normal. We're very normal here. Everything is super normal. I am... God, every time I hear that noise. The power's off. Yeah, yeah, the power's off. We know the power's off. Where's the laundry room? House of Zane, renowned filmmaker, established artist commune in Bright Falls. Uh, We need the code from the laundry room. That we have not come across. A third manuscript page, okay. Sydney Weaver had always kept her lantern close. Someone in the bathroom with her. In the dark. Dark water pressed itself into her. Cynthia Weaver was the she light. Screamed. Cynthia was the the woman with the light, right? In from the first game. She was the light keeper. Uh wait, hold on. Cynthia corrupted. Yes. Cynthia Weaver hated being old. She'd been a doer. A fighter. Now the bathroom frightened her. Afraid she'd break her hip. Like Norman. Did Cynthia Norman break his hip in the bathroom? Close, I mean, to hold the dark they do say day. the leading cause oh dear, of death for old lantern, people uh, I think I've lost it, is accidents. Said, this will put a smile back on your face, my dear, a voice said. A man's voice. Someone in the bathroom with her. That's, I would be, dark, I would be afraid. The light bulb had blown. She meant to replace it days ago. How could she forget? She had slipped getting out of the tub. She lay in the tub now. She lifted her hand. It looked wrong. Too many hands. In a black void with no sense of up or down. Mm -hmm. She was underwater. A dark shape pushed her down. Dark water pressed itself into her. She screamed. It came out of bubbles. Oh, this is the... Okay, this is like the, the connection between what we just did in Alan's story. Do we have the we have the basement map? Yeah, we do. Okay. We're in the laundry room now, so that's good. Oh, there's arrows in that room that we didn't pick up. Let me. We need a fuse. Or we need the code at least. Oh, thank God. All right. Where is the code? Give me the code. Uh, 273. No? Uh-uh. Uh-uh, no. Stop that. <laughs> I will not... This is not an acceptable... I'm gonna get attacked. But we're gonna... From where? I don't know. Can I open? I opened that one. All right, so 273. Thank you. Fuse, please. I'm gonna grab this fuse and someone's gonna fucking grab me. Nope. No. Absolutely not. 
Oh, there was arrows in there. That's where they were. Isn't this where the... Stop making those noises. There. Power's back. You can't get me in here. This is a safe room. Get out of my inventory. I don't need arrows. I have it. Can you get over there where I actually need you to be? Get. Thank you. Okay. Can I? Why can't I pick you up? Thank you. That's what we needed. <sighs> All right, so the power is back on, which means we can actually watch this. Is this something they watch on movie night? It's a film. That looks just like Casey. It's Alex Casey. What the hell is going on? Wait, is this is this Thomas Zane's film? Is it his companion piece? Yotan Yo? It's all in, in Swedish and Finnish. I don't. I don't. I under, I don't understand any of it. What am I looking at? Yotanyo. Sauna da Vista. Well, that was existentially horrifying. Great. I'm glad we watched that. I think it's time for us to leave. Shit. Careful, Saga. Miss Weaver? Did we not open this from the other side? Hold on. I'm gonna fix that really quick. I just, I don't like the idea of having left a door unopened, you know? Wait. I can't get through this. That one's also locked. Never mind. It was locked on both sides. Great. Well, no, hold on. Back, back this way. Miss Weaver, I feel for you. However, stop being horrifying for like five seconds. If you could, if I don't know if you have it in you. Oh, thank you. Computer. Is that the only thing? Oh, wait, oh, there's another thing. More arrows. It really wants me to have crossbow bolts. But the problem is, <laughs> I left my crossbow. Hello? All right, well, we turn the power back on. You can't terrify me this time. Wait, we didn't go up to the... Hold on. This is a hiking, climbing area prohibited. Well, we're gonna go there after this. Oh, I should have known. I should have known there was another page here. Odin loses an eye. It's 1988, a face-off between deities on the rim of Cauldron Lake, high above its dark waters. Thunder roared. The old gods facing something even more powerful, something harder to define even, or changing the perspective, raving lunatics all, caught up in the frenzy of a shared delusion. The old gods, the corsairs of the Sea of Night, and the Dark, and one. The dark one, who yearned to stand in between, who had always stood in between, who would soon stand in between. We help you, you stay away from our family, Tor Anderson snarled over the thunder. Yes. Until you all come to me, came the answer. That's never gonna happen, shouted Odin. I will take this as collateral, shall you remember our deal, said the Dark One. Huh. Blood arched from Odin's face as he fell to his knees. 
Lightning hit the dark figure on the cliff, and with that, he was gone. Tor rushed to his brother. Wait. Are you all right, bro? Effectively blind in that moment, the eye patch covering his left eye, his hand over the now empty socket of his right, blood oozing out of it. Odin cursed. The bastard took the wrong eye. Okay, wait, so... 1988 was when Warland Dor went missing, right? Yeah. He got struck by lightning. Wasn't the whole thing that they saw he got struck by lightning and he vanished? So wait, is Warland Dor the dark one? I don't fucking know anymore. It's all so esoteric. Who are any of these people? Cynthia. Hey, Cynthia. I need you to calm down. Yeah, I know you're underwater. We're trying to fix that. Ati? Ati, are you okay? Ati? Ati, what's up? Yeah, I know. I'm more I'm worried about all that crashing too. He had it coming. He had it coming. He only had himself to blame. Gross. A down? Was Cynthia into civil engineering? Well, that's where she had hung out previously. Let's see. The dark presence uses people's memories. Their fears, fears to corrupt, corrupt them. them. Yeah, it does that. Tom's lamp is gone. The lamp with the angel on it. He always, yeah, it's in the dark place. I have nothing left of Tom. No light, no more lamps. I can't find my way out of the room. It's down there, a newspaper article about Tom, but it called him a filmmaker. Interesting. Interesting. The, the plot thickens. Um, the plot continues to thicken. Cynthia has things to say. Thomas Cynthia Zane. Was close to someone named Thomas Zane. Is he? Tom was back. Tom had enemies. <laughs> Fancy hotel. Just his imagination. A nightmare started to creep in. Cynthia Weaver smiled. An old flame. Maybe Tom was taken. Was he? I don't know if that's true. We still don't have, yeah, we still have all this stuff that we can't unlock yet. We're like starting to piece together some shit slowly but surely. A power station. Yeah, this is all stuff from the first Everyone game. Everyone needs a hobby, I guess. A lantern. Was Cynthia using it for protection? She was the lady, lady of the light. Yeah. Did she know about the dark presence? She absolutely did. I feel like I'm missing some context here. You're missing the entire context of the first I'm game, yes. The woman in this photograph was not Cynthia's favorite. Isn't that Barbara? She's like the uh, Bob Bar Barbara. I forget what her name. Tor's a romantic, huh? Very special woman. For a very special lady. Get get Ilmo and Yako's chocolates for your very special girl in your life. Certainly not poisonous or terrible. Get me that manuscript page. Tell me what's going Cynthia on. would deal with the nasty Anderson fellow, Tor, always poking people with his hammer. That's. He had it coming. Is that innuendo? What do you mean it's currently unavailable? Let me use it. We gotta listen. Cynthia Weaver smiled. Oh, wait, that's the wrong one. Lantern? Nonsense. Oh, no, this is the right one. Cynthia felt as giddy as a young girl in love. 
Cynthia had loved Thomas Zane. Tom only had eyes. It for was Barbara. Barbara. Okay. Barbara was bad news. She wasn't good. Tom had seen it in the end. Cynthia had been there to comfort him. And when he left, Cynthia waited. Years of waiting. Now Tom had come back to her. They'd be together now. See the world. She'd always dreamed of seeing New York. They were there now in a fancy hotel. She drew a bath. She would become like Barbara. No. Better. She sank into dark water. Into Tom. Tom had enemies plotting against him. Cynthia would deal with the nasty Anderson fellow, Tor, always poking people with his hammer. He had it coming. Anything for Tom. Oh, I, yeah. I don't know. I don't know anymore. It's all so confusing. Give me the record. Anger's remorse by old gods of We're going to get ourselves into that overlap. Cynthia? No. No. No, I say. Can I get can I get into this room? Ati has locked this one. I can't actually get into this one. Ati, let me in. Oh my god. Alright, well to the record. To the record machine, I guess. That Who is it? I don't like you. Where'd the water go? Stay out of the water. I don't like you. Get here, take this. Take that. Are you dead? Oh my god. Who are you? Are you Cynthia? Oh no, she lost her bingo card. Oh, she's lost without her bingo card. Hold on, we gotta heal. We gotta heal real quick. All right, we should be okay now. Uh, anger's remorse. The song will show. Look in the mirror. The cobweb of my soul. The overlap is at the pond. My face forever. Fuck. We're going in. It's time for us to fight Cynthia. Oh, God, this is not good. Um.